Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be underway very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. The teams then, Real Betis against Real Madrid. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. I've been hit by it too. the lineups for the game. So it's away we go then. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? A guy born to be a footballer, Luka Modric. Always thinking about his next move due to the fact his, his technical ability is so strong, astute and intelligent. He's, um, he's such a telling passer. He would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. Decent strike, kept it fizzing low. There was very good technique and, and purity behind the hit, but the accuracy was, was just a little off there, Peter. Well, he has a bit of a reputation from that sort of range, Peter, and he can't half smack one. Well, that's what's called setting his stall out. They've begun with great conviction, and Everton goal are mounting up. This is good play. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Boon forward. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Plays it out to the wing. Sergio Ramos tries the route one option. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo can't hurt you with his back to goal and I think if they can keep him facing in that direction then the only thing he can do really is to just lay the ball off and, and is that a foul yes the uh, referee's given it <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo A loose ball away from immediate danger Campbell gets it back still goalless Campbell tries to get it forward quickly Rafael Varane aimed long and direct Modric. Oh, good interception. Balls loose. Who's getting there? Campbell. Hoists it high. Amat. Cristiano Ronaldo. Brings it forward. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Thank <laughs> you. 
Cristiano Ronaldo, not one to pass up the chance to run up the defence. He loves those duels. And that's what you call going solo. He may have taken... That's clear cut. It's a free kick. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Modric. Now it's Isco. Surely! Great strike! But the keeper's equal to it! Sergio Ramos lays it backwards, and they'll try again. Goal! Real Madrid! Isco did well there. He was on to it in a trice. Well, this is the last line of defence, and you don't get it right, then you're paying a visit to your net. Real Madrid take the lead. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Campbell tries a long pass towards the front. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Played out to the wing. Campbell fires it in low. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Isco pumps it upfield. It's anyone's ball. Throw it. Footwork. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So your views on the first half? Well, I think the scoreline offers a fair reflection of the level of endeavour from both teams. I think. <laughs> is back on the way. Real Madrid going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. It's Bale. Now it's Benzema. Benzema plays it out to the flank. Ball swung in. And back out it comes. Clears it out of harm's way. How about it? They've managed to get it away. Fine defending there. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Uh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Amat. Rafael Baran comes out on top in a really physical duel. Shot a goal! Oh, listen, I think you can understand at times that the pace of the game pressures players into split-second decisions, and sometimes they just make the wrong one, and I think he would have been better placing that. And it's Modric. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. 
Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Who's going to make this theirs? He's made sure that that won't get through. Amat. Guatado, out wide to the right. Can he put it away? Good, strong hand by the keeper. An absolute thunderbolt. Oh, it really is a finish of the highest order. Unbelievable. Real Betis back on level terms. Well, it was a hefty deflection, but he's claiming it. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. That has certainly made things interesting. Look, get your seatbelts on because this is showing all the signs of another roller coaster ride. Gets up to head it! Goal! Real Madrid! And they get themselves in front! That is a fine goal, really efficiently done. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Real Madrid take the lead. Look, he's the one everyone expects to put the ball in the net. That's what he's paid to do. Out to the left it goes. Oh, flags up. Thrust towards the front line. Looks to slip it through. Tried to play it through. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. Cristiano Ronaldo he is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Yeah, now that he scored, this defence is on high alert whenever he, he goes anywhere near the ball. Campbell. Looks like a good ball through. Campbell needed to come up with a better ball. The idea was good, though, Peter. And I like the run that triggered the pass, but the quality was the problem. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. Looking to shoot! Balls come loose, and the chase is on. You can get that clear. There's a real confidence about them, and they look as though fitness levels and energy are still strong, but they have to maintain possession. They can't afford to lose it again. Well played, he saw that coming. Spoon forward. He acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. Shoots! World-class Karim Benzema! And that should do it! Within sight of the finish line! <laughs> Pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Real Betis have decided now is the time to make their final change. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Real Madrid, two up and into a position of real strength. Crosses it in low. Isco pumps it upfield. Campbell gets his foot in there. Now it's Benzema. Defenders on the back foot. He's off on a marauding run. 
Oh, that's neat. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Oh, it looked like a training ground drill that almost worked a treat, only for that flag to go up. He just went a tad early. Aimed long and direct. Modric. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's dealt with that well. Tries a through ball. Now the pass. The final whistle. Real Madrid claim victory here, and on balance, they were worth it. Your final thoughts, Jim? They've achieved this away win thanks to a game plan which they stuck to and trusted from start to finish. The players deserve praise. And